people on the outside would be surprised to find out that the swamp is uh, pretty giving if, if you look at it in the right way. Sometimes I sit out here for days and days and days and don't speak to a soul. And when someone does come up, they're in for it. Captain Natural. My name is Captain Natural and I am what I am. And uh, just like Popeye the Sailor Man. I call myself Captain Naturally because I'm the captain, naturally. I'm the captain of my own ship. I'm the captain of my own life. I'm the captain of my own destiny. I'm not a, a licensed captain for a ship. Don't want to be. So I chose to be a writer and do what I'm doing. And I learned to live off the, uh, the land, so to speak. I mean, I never know what's around the next pin. I wear a lot of different hats. <laughs> a lot of different hats. I've gone from cowboy hats to sailor hats to baseball hats to beaters. I mean, I've worn them all. Society drives me nuts. It's, it's not really nuts. It's just crazy. <laughs> not to get political, but yeah, you know, I, 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 I do inhale. I just want people to get along, Rodney King. <laughs> you know, I'm looking for Tom Sawyer, which is the basis for my adventure right now. And uh, I think of uh, Mark Twain as my mentor. Why not have a Huckleberry houseboat? There's three things I follow in life. Patience, perseverance, persistence, and confidence. Even though I live on a raft on the boat on the river, I'm a Trekkie. I call myself a self-made man, a uh, renaissance man. I've been called that before by other people. Other people have called me insane. And my uh, first grade report card, <laughs> my teacher told my mother that I was a born leader. <laughs> kind of like Cuckoo Pelly, my little alter ego. Cuckoo changes physically. I can wear this loincloth today Tomorrow I can walk in and put myself into a tuxedo and go to a, the Academy Awards if I wanted to. Uh, can I get off the raft <laughs> now? <laughs>